back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be reacting to a letter I wrote myself a year ago. Like, a full year ago. I can't believe it's been a full year since I wrote this. I'm literally so excited. I haven't read it since the day I wrote it. I'm not even lying when I say that. I haven't even opened it or touched it. Like, it's been in a box for a full year. And it's now getting ready to read. I am so excited. So if you want to know what I've wrote in this letter and see my reaction, then keep on watching. I don't remember what I've wrote in this. I don't even remember if it's long, if it's short. I'm scared in case there's some personal things in there that I don't want to mention in the video. But if there is, then I'll probably just bleep it out. Um, hopefully it's not all personal though. But yeah, I'm going to open it right now. I can't believe I'm actually opening this right now. It says, do not open until the 29th of November 2019 on the front of it. And it's currently the 29th of November 2019. I want to try and prove it to you. Um, it's Black Friday today. It's Friday. I'm working and, uh, and really soon. I promise you it's 29th of November 2019. So we're just going to open this. Ah! Is there anything else on the envelope? No. Okay, so this. Oh my God, it's double-sided. What? Wait, can you even see that look? Right. Oh my god, that's so weird. It's the exact time on it. Oh, I don't even want to like read this. That's gonna make me emotional, I bet. Because I went through a lot last year and like the end of the year before, so I don't even want to read this. I'm so nervous. Why am I so nervous? Right, I just need to eat my pot noodle. Mm. That was so good. So at the top it says 29th of November 2018, 5.58pm. Hi Becca, with a smiley face. Can't forget the smiley face. It's currently 2018, 4 weeks till Christmas. Oh my god, it's 4 weeks till Christmas, I didn't even know that. Cheers for the fact, Becca. <laughs> and I'm still not excited. Oh, okay. You're kind of moody, aren't you? <laughs> I currently have a brown slash blonde patchy mess in my hair right now, which I'm hoping to get fixed in the next few weeks. So that didn't actually end up happening. I ended up um, just doing it myself. So I cut my hair. Um, I cut it, I think I cut it to about this length actually, and dyed it brown with like a box dye because my hair is naturally dark, dark brown, but I got like blonde highlights put in it like last year at some point and it was a mess. I'm sitting in my living room at, oh, my, that's my address, I nearly said my address. Basically, I said I'm sitting in my living room at this house, <laughs> watching the news. Um, I recently moved from my last address. We lasted six months. <laughs> yeah, we move a lot. <laughs> um, my current friendship group is me, Sophie B. Hi, so the only reason I am cutting the names out of the friendship group I used to be in is only because... I don't speak to the girls, or I don't speak to many of the girls that I was in the friendship group with anymore, so I didn't really want to put them in the video in case they didn't want to be mentioned. That is all. Bye bye. My true friend is Mia. She's always there for me, and I'm so grateful for her. 2017 was the worst year for me, to be honest. I never thought it would get better. It has, but I'm still not the happiest. I started 2018 off with. But we fell out a few times. I spent my 15th birthday with Samantha. And then it was so good. Summer started so well. My friendship group was... Oh, I can't. <laughs> I'm going to cry. This is not okay. I said basically a few names that... Well, I said a certain name that... I just don't even want to... Even, I don't even want the name to come out of my mouth. But... We hung out for the most of the summer. We all got so close, but at the end of the summer, oh my God, why did I write that? But at the end of the summer, basically something that happened. Um, I was and still am um, in so much shock. I'm learning to move past it now, but it's still hard. I'm still currently not at school, but I'm hoping to start working in January in college after the summer. I'm also looking forward to saving for a car. And for my 16th birthday. <laughs> my 16th birthday, woo! That was so good actually, my 16th birthday. It was kind of chill, but it was actually really good. Um, I'm currently saving for a car. 
and I didn't end up going to college or work in January but I did start working properly start working in September um, and uh, I didn't end up going to college but I went to like a beauty school so I've got my qualifications and everything now so that's really good. I'm still not the happiest, I've been arguing with my mum a lot and I feel like I can never talk to her anymore. I hope our relationship improves. Um, the thing with that is, it's not like me and my mum have a bad relationship. I know she loves me and she knows I love her and we're really good and close and I could like, you know, tell her anything and stuff like that like she has a really amazing mum I have amazing parents they are they do nothing to hurt me obviously we just argue like mother and daughter and like teenagers you know hormones like I'm moody we just kind of argue like that it's not like serious arguing like she doesn't hit me or anything like that she doesn't leave me or anything she's an amazing parent but um by that I just mean like because we do argue quite a lot but it's just because we're so similar like me and my dad my mum and my dad are literally the same but me and my dad don't argue like ever really because we're not like similar in the sense of like we clash whereas me and my mum clash like we just like we just argue <laughs> but we get over it in the matter of minutes and we're fine again like it's just the way it is because we're just so similar she's not a bad mum she's an amazing mum um but yeah i just think by that because i was going through like a horrible stage at that point where I felt like no one cared and I felt like I couldn't go to anyone when I could but I just didn't feel like I could um, and just like I was just not okay so <laughs> I hope to make new friends in college and I hope I enjoy my course I'm still aspiring to be a makeup artist and slash influencer I hope 2019 is my best year I have high hopes see you in 2019 365 days Oh my god, yeah, 365 days, that was 365 days ago. So yeah, that is that, that is my little letter. That is so, I'm keeping that, honestly, I'm keeping that. And I'm not gonna, I'm gonna write a new one for next year and I'm gonna do this video again next year. I'm so glad I've done that because it just shows how far I've came in the sense of, you know, happiness. Because I was so down at that point, I was not okay. <laughs> um just yeah it was like last year was a lot of like highs and lows and at the end of the year I just really did hit a low I was just not okay but I'm so much happier now I'm literally living my best life I'm just so happy with how everything is at the moment I'm happy with work with you know like I, I'm able to go places myself and stuff I never could have done that last year I know that sounds ridiculous but if anyone has ever went through I don't know like anxiety or depression or anything like that where you can't leave the house alone when you can't go far from your house alone um you know you'll understand um because it isn't ridiculous when you think about it but like you know there is a reason for it it's because i was going through you know mental health issues but I can literally go anywhere I can, anywhere I want. I like myself now. Um, I have a job now. I've got all my qualifications now. I'm literally like doing so much more than I thought I would be doing this year. And I'm happy with how friendships and everything are at the moment as well. So yeah. But I have no hate towards them. It's just the way life works. We all drift and go in different groups. So that's what happened but apart from that everything is just amazing like my life is so much better now i'm gonna rewrite this letter maybe make it a wee bit longer and then react to this in one year time this isn't going to be getting posted on the 29th um this year because i have another video going up today um because i post on friday i have a christmas gift guide going up today and then next week i've got another christmas gift guide going up um, and then the following week I'll probably post this video so this probably won't come out until like about December time but I might try and post that the video at the same point as that I don't really know but I will see you all next year for another reaction of another letter I'm gonna keep doing this this is like the best thing I've ever done and I'm so happy and I can't believe it's been a year since I've wrote this which feels like yesterday <laughs> but anyway I hope you guys enjoyed um and 
if I think I, I honestly recommend anybody to do this or even make yourself a little video. I did, oh this is so annoying because I made a video last, last New Year. Before I even had a channel I just made a video talking to myself about like, oh, like oh, reacting to the video in a year's time. Um, but I deleted it because my storage on my phone and it's so annoying that I done that because like oh, it's just so annoying like why did I do that? I am gonna try and maybe film a video as well for um, to react to in five years time because I've seen quite a lot of them and I really want to do that because I think it would be really good. I did film it but I had to delete it because my storage storage is such a pain in the butt man but i hope you all enjoyed this video anyway look at our presents <laughs> anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i will see you all next week for a brand new video happy christmas Woo <laughs>